How many of us have ever done something or said something or dressed a certain way just to feel a sense of acceptance or belonging? I think in this world, there is a need for people to become authentic, to become, to come back to who they truly are and express themselves. So the world can learn, the world can learn from one another instead of all being sheep and following each other, not daring to truly be ourselves. The world will be so much more colorful and it does take courage. It does take courage to stand out. It does take courage to be yourself. But guess what? It also is the only way for you to feel fully free. If you can become yourself, meaning that you can unlayer all the programming, all the conditioning, all the BS beliefs that are not true, all the limiting beliefs that are keeping you small or keeping you in a comfortable life, not a life that is aligned with your highest possible version of who you truly can become or who you truly actually are, but that you are now separate from because you're afraid to get judged by people, which is totally legit because people do judge. We live in a world where judgment is a really big thing. And I've gone through that personally as well. And what I can tell you from experience is that when you start truly stepping into your own power, meaning that you start to accept the person who you are without projecting any perfectionistic views of what you should be, what you should be doing, how you should be dressing, or how you should be showing up to the world, just simply accepting yourself and your flaws and all, but also your talents and your uniqueness and your weirdness. When you can start fully embracing yourself, coming back to yourself, that's when you start to set yourself free. That's where you will discover, oh, I'm actually very talented at this. Perhaps I could monetize this skill in order to, to live in a way that is aligned to who I am. And so we live in a world that will judge. The truth is that people who have accomplished more than you do in your field or people who have, who are doing more than you are doing are not judging you. They're cheering you on. People who do less than you, people who don't dare to step into their full potential, people who are not continuously working on their freedom and their spiritual growth and their personal growth, they are the ones who are judging you because what you are doing, how you are showing up to the world is simply too much for them to process because they don't have the courage to show up fully and authentically doing what they love. So the real question truly is, is if you're feeling judged, how much is their judgment worth to you? If they live a life that you don't desire to live, then their judgment shouldn't matter because it doesn't mean anything. Truth bump there. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments if you have felt any judgment whatsoever on your journey of personal development and personal growth. I for sure know that I've dealt with it very, very much. And what I can say is that it only makes you stronger and it only makes you realize how not important judgment from other people is. And as long as we validate ourselves, there is no being judged anymore. There is no being afraid of judgment anymore 
because we validate ourselves. If you have liked this video, make sure to like this video as this video needs to be spread out to anyone who needs to hear this today. And for those of you who are new here and haven't already subscribed to my channel, remember to do so as you will be the first to watch all of my videos every Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays so that you can create your best life. Remember, we have such an exciting future to look forward to even if it doesn't seem like it right now. Thank you so much for being here, and I am looking forward to see you in the next video. Bye for now.